Hello everyone, my name is Francesco Guayana and I'm a master's student in the ICT for Smart Society course at Politecnico di Torino. Today I'm going to present you the database platform for supporting profit-driven strategy in the Italian spot electricity markets. First of all, I would like to introduce the context. Starting from the 1996, the competition in the electricity markets all over the Europe has considerably increased. Like any competitive market, this has produced a technological advance in the industry to cut costs and increase profits. Over the last 40 years, a significant effort has been made in modeling markets and formulating suitable algorithms based on nonlinear programming, game theory and equilibrium model. Several machine learning and deep learning models, such as the convolutional neural network and long short-term memory, have been investigated to predict the electricity market price. The main lack found in literature is the absence of solutions that combine model and prediction, taking into account all the components of market. For this reason, our solution tries to fill that gap by proposing a web-based modular platform in Python designed for companies operating in the Italian market by considering all the market session, the MGP, MI and MSD. Moreover, our forecast is not limited to the electricity price, but attempts to predict the strategy of other players. The platform implements a full machine learning pipeline, starting from collecting real data, querying and processing them, and feeding them to different algorithms for optimization, exploiting the Django framework and several IT tools. Our system is able to clear simultaneously three submarkets, and uh, it is scalable and generalizable for other European markets. To implement the microservice approach, the virtualization tool Docker is used. Each service is configured as a standalone application running on a doc container, communicating each other. The figure highlights the four services. A Python-based web crawler model retrieves the information from GME internal websites. It comprehends a data processor that pulls and trims data. The data are sent to the storage module, providing interface among other microservices, exploiting the InfluxDB. The prediction service performs the forecasting of the strategies of other market players for the next day, as well as the market clearing quantities and prices through the ARIMA algorithm. The web application calls the back-end optimization based on a genetic algorithm and processes the results in a clear and user-friendly way to the front-end. The operator strategy consists of the demanded and offered energy prices and quantities related to each market. A more detailed description of that is presented by my colleague Luca Gioacchini. The several combinations of Arima hyperparameters were tried with a sliding wind of 60 days and the best combination found is the 010, meaning that the models learn only by a shifted version of the target variable, treated as time series. Regarding the market modeling, the main equation represents the operator profit, defined as the difference between the offered energy quantities in each market and the demanded one, times the relative prices. The maximization of this equation constitutes the objective function of the optimization model. It has been decided to use a genetic algorithm, which is the most innovative solution found in literature, with the following hyperparameters. The operator strategy variable are treated as genus. The entire process can be summarized in three steps, starting from the output of the machine learning algorithm, then change the bidding strategy of the considered player, being sure to be accepted in the market, even changing the clearing price. The platform has a sign-up and sign-in form. After having registered the company and successfully logged in, each operator can access a personal dashboard, showing its bidding history in terms of offered and demanded daily energy quantities and prices among the three sub-markets. By providing the company production limit, the virtual advisor exploits the embedded algorithms and model to provide the best bidding strategy. The dashboard displays the resource allocation to each market and the relative prices. 
The main introduced innovation consists of clearing the tree spot market at the same time, ensuring the operator market acceptance and providing an optimal resource allocation to increase the revenues. Lower, an interactive picture shows the profit maximization trend. Looking at the upper figure, the forecasting curve in red is barely recognizable from the original one, confirming the 100% of error score and the mean absolute percentage error around 3%. A single day of strategy variable is forecasted among all the operators. The lower plot on the left shows a quite high estimation accuracy being the absolute point-wise forecasting error less than 2500 both megawatt hour and euro per megawatt hour for most of the cases. The, fig the figure on the right shows that the platform can generally increase the profits of the market participants. It fails only for 16 of them. We also randomly selected a market participant as a case study. The optimization model leads to a 127% profit increase with respect to the forecasted one after approximately 300 generations of the optimization process. The results show that in this particular case, the player can obtain higher profits by reducing the quantities and adjusting the prices across different markets. Summarizing, our analysis shows an increase in profit for 192 companies out of 208. As already mentioned, the platform is modeled on the Italian spot market, but with a small modification, it can be applied to other national markets. There is something to take into account to evaluate our work. The valuation of the profit doesn't consider the production cost of the electricity. Furthermore, the physical constraints of the network are not taken into consideration, but the security needs of TSO are reflecting them and included in our model. Finally, the um, service dispatching market that is the most remunerative one is cleaned exploiting a dummy creating price. The main advantage with respect to other platforms is that the only user input is the production limit. In conclusion, we are very satisfied with our work and we think that it can serve both individual market operators and the regulator of the market to prevent some scenarios. Furthermore, the performance metrics are really good both for the forecasting model and the optimization process. The last one can go from 10 seconds up to 2 minutes. This work can set the stage for a more detailed analysis on other market scenarios. That's all, so thank you for your time.